Good morning, good morning. Can we wait for a while? For all those for some people to come in first, then we're gonna start uh, the topic of today. Then we're gonna start uh, our topic for today. So for those who uh, already passed through yesterday, then we're gonna to have uh, another topic. Okay. <clears throat> After yesterday's uh, sharing section, so if, if let's say for those that you all wanted to get the PPT as a reference, remember to join our. You get the groups, you get the bright start, you get the elite groups. Okay, so comment on the group that uh, so I'll help us help us to prepare the slides. Okay, for you all. For a while, so if let's say that you all have any questions, remember to feel free to comment, okay, or PM us to let us know. Then we're going to have to explain uh, to you for the more more details. So if let's say that you want to have a uh, uh, to search uh, all those uh, video that's very premium, uh, do it on live. Remember to go to our Ikato Elegate. Okay, all those videos we're going to have uh, in that and our Ikato Forest Academy and Ikato Group as well. Those who just come in, remember to help me to like and share. So wait for a while for more people to come in. Then we're gonna start our topic for today. So for those who miss out yesterday, so if let's say that you wanted to have the okay uh, the video or the PT as reference, remember to comment us. Please join us at Ikato Elite Groups. Okay, then PM us on the video. Our small helper are gonna help us to uh, send all those profile for you okay and the ppt as well okay so today we got a little bit on the workspace and uh price up manual so for today we're going to go a little bit more details into coffee okay and with some today we're going to go more deeply into coffee of parts. Okay. So while we're waiting, so if let's say that for those uh, who have questions, you want know, to comment, ask us, so we can have a small discussion over here. 
Okay, for those results, uh, remember to go to our Ikato Elite groups, okay, all those videos we're going to have over there. If let's say that after you all uh, choose or watch the video that you want, okay, if you feel, if you feel that you want the uh, PPT app reference, remember to comment on below to let us know. So, Okay, so I think we can uh, start. So before we start, uh, my name is Ken. I'm from Ikado Group. So I'm the Bright Star Trainer for Ikado Group and I'm also SCA certified trainer. So, okay, so normally I have uh, students uh, not only from Malaysia but from uh, around the world as well. So I have more than uh, thousands of students has been trained uh, since 2013. Okay, then I have been more. I have more than ten thousands of training experience as well. Okay, so if let's say that you wanted to have some uh, help, okay, on basic trainings, menu that we bring, remember to PM us. Okay, so first of all, remember to join our groups for Ikado Barista Academy and Ikado Groups, so that uh, you can get the first hand of notifications that what kind of courses and classes that we're gonna to go on uh, time to time. It on Facebook. So it's normal. So let me have quick introductions uh, of my companies. So our company name is uh, Ikato. So uh, you can saw two lovely persons over there. Let me just have full screen for you all. So, okay. So our company starts at two thousand eight. Okay. Uh, by Miss Nicole and Mr. Ho. So when the time that they start up, uh, it's called TLH Sales and Services. Okay, then until uh, 2010, they only changed the name to Ikado Groups until today. So when they start up, they start up from uh, Soho base. And until today, then we have our uh, own showroom. So we have our own factory as well. <clears throat> so they do help, okay, and they do bring a lot of uh, ideas, trainings, all the teams in the company. Okay, for those who wanted to have uh, some ideas, so, or if let's say that for those who wanted to come up to so our showroom, so this is some of the pictures that actually uh, show on our showroom. So on the left hand side, that we have our, that is our main door. For those who want to come over, remember to recognize our sidewalk. So on the right hand side is the place that uh, where we do our training, okay? For no matter it's for trainings or for some uh, demonstrations or testing sections. Okay, then uh, on the below will be the certificate that uh, we are getting uh, passed through the years. And this is some of the award as well that uh, we're getting uh, on 2017 and 2018. Okay, so such as uh, 100 Moon Influential Young Entrepreneurs, Nanyang uh, Super Brand Awards. So SME hundreds awards, Golden Eagle awards, and of course in two business excellent awards. So this is all those awards that we'll be getting past four years. Then come, come to our lovely founder, Miss Nicole. Okay, so Miss Nicole will be uh, mostly handling on all those uh, sales and marketing. So if let's say that uh, you are facing problem that uh, you want to get more ideas on how to develop or how to work in your cafe and restaurants remember to drop us a pm okay so we can have a discussion section with her and next this is our co-founder so if let's say that you have uh, any problem that you face on machines okay tools that you want to have comparisons or you want to know more details he will be the one especially on technicals and uh, our machinery then this is some of the photo that uh, we're getting passed through the years on our team, like uh, SME hundreds on Chinese Syria and our team photo shooting and video shootings. So we also corporate uh, doing corporate socials responsibilities such as uh, old folks homes, or we go to those primary school that actually teach students on how normally they make coffee. Okay, uh, simple uh, the steps of the making of coffee. So this is one of the part that actually uh, is quite important 
nowadays okay it's coffee beans so for those who wanted to have uh, you all wanted to try uh, new blends of coffee beans or new coffee uh, new types of coffee beans or you want to have your own OEM coffee beans remember to let us know okay we do help customers to do their own OEMs or create some blending as well and we also have our own roasting over here so for those who wanted to know more on roasting okay feel free to drop us a message have a appointment with us, then you can come up uh, to have a look so to let us know okay to let you know that actually uh, what is roasting and what going to be in roasting normally <coughs> okay this is our company and our sister company sister brother company as well so uh, for Ikedo groups what Ikedo Singapore TRH Sales and Services Ikedo Academy Ikedo East Coast Norton and Strait okay so this is our uh, company profile okay then come to here uh, like I always say every single day I'll mention remember to go to our Ikedo groups uh, Facebook page okay remember to like and share follow us Okay, so that you can have the first hand updated information no matter it's on online class or on other offline class okay that will be held on our premises so what's normally that uh, Ikedo do okay we do supply actually coffee tea cereal and sauces so other than that uh, we also supply uh, machine as well okay no matter it's for fully auto or semi-automated uh, coffee machines so for those who want to, if let's say that uh, you already have your coffee machine at home that you want to have some maintenance, okay, or repair. So remember to uh, let us know as well. We do provide uh, equipment maintenance and uh, services as well. So we also help uh, cafe, restaurants create some new drinks or limited time offer, okay, for them to use on their uh, events uh, times or some special seasons. Okay, for those who wanted to have a uh, price training on the cafe or restaurants, we also do provide uh, training as well. So if let's say that you have new staff, okay, you feel that uh, your barista wanted to get some uh, training on how they brew coffees or how they make coffees. So we do provide this kind of training. So if let's say that you wanted to know more, remember to PM us. Okay, next, okay. Okay, other than online classes, actually we have our time-to-time -time offline class as well. So this will be the sum of offline classes that uh, we are going through time-by-time, uh, -time, such as basic pasta skill, latte art, introduction to hand brew, cupping and sensory roasting. For those who wanted to have a mix and match on the syrups that we make, so coffee and tea appreciations, advanced latte art. So for those wanted to set up okay a new cafe or you all wanted to just wanted to come into uh, the industry of FMB, so we do provide a cafe set up management as well. For those who are coffee lover that you wanted to know more details into uh, coffee profile, coffees, uh, the things related to coffee. So we have SCA for barista and roasting as well. So for introductions, foundation, intermediate, and professional level. Okay, then let's come on. This will be the okay the page of our Ikedo Barista Academy. Remember the uh, okay uh, updates. So all those uh, video normally that they will show on Ikedo Barista Academies. So if let's say that you want to get uh, all those details and PPT, remember to comment. Okay. Then we're going to have our uh, video premium time to times. Okay. Then if let's say that you wanted to know the updates on uh our courses or classes or if let's say that you want to know like what is the when we'll be going to have our sharing sections so remember to follow us on Ikedo Barista Academy and Ikedo Elite Group so we'll post it and update it on these two groups okay so how do you join Ikedo Elite Group so remember first go to Ikedo Barista Academy okay like share follow us so or you can direct key in Ikato Elite Groups, okay? E C I A T T O E I T E. So just click join in. Our helper will going to bring you in, okay, to let you to have uh, the first end updates, okay? 
on what kind of courses that we're going to make or we're going to do. So, let's go on. Okay, we're going to go on today. It's our day two. Yesterday, that we're going to go through on some uh, Brysa workspace. Okay, then we do mentions on some Brysa menus or rings. So, for today, we're going to go to uh, the module of coffee beans. Oh, okay. So, today, we're going to go into coffee beans as well. So, let's go on. on this. Okay. So, we do know that actually uh, a lot of uh, people who drink coffee, okay, nowadays, time by time, Hello, Hafiz. Good morning. Good morning, Hafiz. See you again. Nice to see you. Okay, so we do, uh, I mentioned this now, we do have a lot of coffee bean species, okay, in the world. Then uh, we do have quite a lot of species as well for the coffee beans that we use. So, uh, based on the photo, you can look on it. Actually, the easiest common way that actually we have separate into two types, okay? Beans that you may not really see it often, but actually if let's say that when you buy a coffee beans, okay, open the bag, okay, you can look into it. You will find some of the coffee beans that actually are two different types, okay, such as left-hand side pea berry, is a little bit round oval then for the regular one is normal flat coffee beans that we saw okay so what is the pea berry actually apply on coffee beans okay so actually it's very rare okay if, uh, if in 100 pieces so maybe you only get five pieces of pea berry okay so pea berry actually do sell more expensive if let's say that you are getting coffee beans that only is pea berry so easiest uh, normal explanations if let's say that you all get uh, a bag of coffee beans open the bag okay you saw two types okay or two patterns so one is pea berry the other one is regular normal flat beans okay based on or uh, what kind of situation that actually uh, come out with th these two different uh, uh, specials or sizes of coffee okay so first of all uh, we all need to know the, let me get a little bit slower so first coffee come from cherry okay each of the cherry actually contain two pieces okay they contain two pieces of coffee beans okay example so this is the cherry so inside the cherry there will be have two pieces but somehow in certain of times that uh, it will only come out one so when this thing happen when this situation happen this is uh, what we call pea berry okay if it's only single then when it's normal okay this is the normal coffee beans that we say okay in another subword actually uh if let's say that you're into uh how do we say indonesia okay or some of the places actually they call pea berry and normal flat beans uh, is male and female coffee okay so if let's say that you heard this word before so for a round single oval is male then a normal flat is female so if let's say that you all drink it so is it it will uh, apply effects on the taste uh, yes okay <clears throat> so when you all the first effect that we will get is uh, when we are doing roasting okay because pea berry is round okay it's totally round so when we roast it, that it will be roast evenly. So uh, comparing with the flats, okay, when we are using drums, based on taste-wise, okay. Okay, actually I tried both. Okay, uh, it didn't give me really a uh, two big difference, okay. Maybe for pea berries that it will have a, how do we say it's a more compound, a complex flavor that's comparing with two flat beans okay that we drink so when you level light machines okay so if let's say that you all feel like remember to let us know yeah because i have a level light over here okay so this is the main two species that uh, we look in coffee so 
let's go on this too. Okay, let's look on the compounds. Okay, some of you may do know the, how to be separate. So this is a photo actually the, that you ought to recognize. Okay, what normally the, when coffees is look like before they have been rolled or before they are in green bean or parchment coffee. Okay, so coffee come in cherry that you can saw uh, on the descriptions on the photo helped okay they have much leach parchment parchment is actually the hardest skin okay for us to keep and store then until the last part only the seeds part there will be the coffee that we use always okay to roast then we're going to get our coffee after you roast then you're going to grind it so only you drink So when we go into coffee beans, okay, common in the market, so for those, for us, ourselves, that's uh, when you all choose coffee beans, okay? So common in the market that you have two types. Okay, you have uh, blends and you have single origin as well. So with these two, you need to really, really uh, go into it, okay? And you need to try, okay? Because this thing actually do need more practice, okay? Such as a uh, price skill as well. So that you all need to keep time to time to train okay and plan will give you so will provide you a different flavor of taste then single origin will be have a level difference so for those who don't know what is a blend and single origins okay easier explanations okay a blend is a blend that actually uh, we call because you are blending between let's say example okay refresh a little bit coffee species that actually we have you have is Arica, Robusta, Librica, Excelsa, Excelsa. Let's say, okay, we have four types of coffee beans. Okay, so if let's say that I'm mixing the Arabica with Robusta, Arabica with Librica, okay, so this will be what we call blend, okay, in the market. Okay, you are blending. Your blending either is one or more than one types of coffee bean in it. Okay, then for single origin, normally is uh, we use or we try it on more specialties. Uh, using more specialty equipments or more specialties profile okay normally single origin will only come from a single farm okay 100 percent doesn't mix didn't mix it that's why when you all buy or when you all are uh, getting single origins that you notice that actually they will name it okay with the area and farm together so they will give you a note okay to help you to develop or to help you to brew correctly so to let you to recognize the flavor and taste easily okay so this is the normal simple how we uh, explain on blends and single origin of course if let's say that we're going to go into it uh, we're going to go in slowly slowly so, okay and this is some of the profile okay actually uh when you are trying single origins and blend the most easiest explanation is so if let's say that you only get a single species okay come from a single farm normally is a uh, is single origins okay if let's say that you are mixing two species okay arabica robusta arabica excelsa arabica liberica or even though you are mixing within one species okay let's say you are getting uh, 70 percent of arabica from farm a okay then you are getting 30 uh, percent of arabica from farm b so you mix it together so it's a hundred percent arabica blend okay single origins it will be only applied on a single farm direct hundred percent come from a single farm okay that is not mixing with others so some some of you may ask is it the effect on the taste yes okay because when you all do blending you have more complexities flavor and taste so you have a possibility that you get a lot of floral fruits uh, mixing in nuts okay chocolate cocoa big bread okay a lot of flavor that complex in one okay single blend so for those who want to develop or recognize uh, a specific flavor of coffee so single origin only come from a single farm okay so they will give you more surprise okay or more uh, things to extract from the coffee so such as if let's say for those wanted to know more or wanted to bring some different flavor come from a different uh, regions of farm okay 
So this is a time that you are choosing for single origin. So examples, what normally drinks is made from single origins and what normally drinks is made from blend, okay? For common in the market, okay, blending that we always, uh, first priority that we use on the espresso, okay, to brew for espresso drinks and our latte cappuccino. So for single origin, normally that we use it for brew, to hand brew, okay? So we use it to use on uh, hand brew V60s, okay? So this is the simple uh, first step, how do we recognize or what do we normally use, okay? For single origin and plants. Okay, so this is normally the, how do we differentiate or what is the things actually we made uh, from, how do we explain from singles and uh, blend. Okay, uh, actually uh, until here, I have a little bit news that actually need to let you all know first, because uh, tomorrow we're going to stop, okay, for a day of uh, our transactions, then we'll keep continue back on Friday, okay. So for those uh, wanted to join us, remember to have our updates on elite groups. So please do join yourself on Ikato Price Academy and Ikato Elite Groups, okay, to have the updated of the schedules. And we are almost coming soon, okay, we're going to post all those uh, schedules for offline, okay, to our showroom, the sections, okay. So if let's say that you wanted to know more, remember to drop us a comment or PM. So to know on the offline classes, okay, or some offline uh, actions that will be held on our showrooms, okay, our showroom is at Cheras. So until here, so if let's say that you have any questions, remember to gather all those questions that you have, okay, to PM us. So tomorrow we're going to stop for a day, so I'm going to see you guys on uh, Friday morning back. Okay, so remember to go through our video, so gather all those questions. If let's say that you have any questions, okay, gather all those questions. So you may, you all may ask me when you all saw me online, okay, or direct PM me. So I will help you to explain further details. So remember, uh, time to time that if let's say that you wanted to know more on uh, what kind of details that uh, actually we all doing time by time. Okay, remember to follow us on Ikado Groups, Ikado Rice Academy, and Ikado Elite Groups. Okay, so we're going to start over here until the origin and blend. So we're going to cut, go into more details on Friday. Then I'm going to see you all on Friday. Okay, I'm Kent. Uh, we are friends behind FMB businesses. So see you all on Friday. Bye bye.